Hello, I'm Avery, and today I'm going to do a review on Ninjago Lloyd's Journey that has a, a, a 81 pieces in the age of 6 to up. We have Lloyd, um, Bex, and then we have Akita over here in wolf form. We have swords, ice, of course, and we got a, a tiny temple in the corner. Um, looks like there's some shooty stuff, so I'm excited for that. Um, so I'm excited to open this up and play with it. the complete set of Lloyd's Journey. We got Lloyd and Akita and Vex. We got Lloyd and Akita fighting Vex because he's evil. And we got a sword and the ice um, which can be easily pulled out. Um, and so what I found interesting about Akita is that she um, kind of reminds me of those uh, horses. She has the big feet of them, the two little humps. The horses have a little, have a little dip so that you can put a saddle on it and you can ride them um, like that. Um, obviously, there's some differences between the horse and Akita, but she's kind of um, taking that same style because her form, because she's a wolf, um, and she takes that form, she's bigger than the dogs that are on Lego. Most of the dogs are pretty small. Um, let me see if I can get <coughs> some things. So we got a horse. She's a little bit shorter than a horse, but she's about, like, the same length of it. But... The feet are one stud, stud uh, each. Both have the two. They're both two wide. Um, they both got a similar size head. She's yeah, she's a little bit smaller than a horse um, in terms of height, but like with lie like. You know, like, they, the feet are the same apart. They're both two studs across. Um, yeah, she's just a little bit shorter than the horse. Um, so here's the, the dogs. So, like, these dogs are, like, one or, only one or two studs. Um... Well, this is the biggest dog that they have. And you can see. They, they're really short. And um, really small. A chihuahua and a... No, this is a German Shepherd. And this is, I think this is a pug. Um, so those are dogs and other sets. And I think part of the reason is because, like, 
since humans are too wide, obviously, like, she has to be too wide. Um, but also, if you lay them across like that, like, he's almost as tall as Nikita this way. So. That's why she's this big. Um, that's, yeah, that's why she's kind of reminds me of the, the shape of, of the, of the horse, you know, modeled for her. Um, we got Vex and his tower. You can put him up here. Let him shoot the cannon at Lloyd. So, <laughs> I had a little bit of difficulty trying to um, put the ice in there. Because usually, like, when I get these kind of guns, like, they're usually, like, put in like this, like, the stud inwards. Or put like that, usually like this. But it's actually <laughs> set where the stud is, like, on top push it in like this. It was actually put in like this instead of put in um can't really see it but like like this. So I had to figure that out. Um but yeah it's cool that they have the shooty thingy. One of the things that I had kind of trouble with was with Lloyd's, um, like, neck gear. Usually, you only do, like, one neck thing at a time because there's only so much space on the neck. So, they're kind of loose, which I, I don't really like. It's kind of unfortunate, but, um, it's still really cool. The way that he looks. Oh, so, there you go. I hope you enjoyed this review on Lloyd's journey. Um, and happy 2020. <laughs>